You guys can get it. It's no medicine or anything. It's not for the week. you guys so this is what i'll be doing the rest of the day um i might get on a treadmill later on today as well i'll show you guys if i do that but um this is pretty much my workout for today this is what i need <laughs> um so yeah y'all look at this one and look at the one that i'm wanting hold on it's a huge difference. Look at this, this is crazy. This is the one I just bought from Target and this is the one that I ordered from Amazon. There was no way I was gonna do anything with this. Now I could definitely keep this for like future workouts, stretches, yoga, whatever the case may be. I was like sitting on the floor when I was sitting on this. But I'm gonna keep it. I was gonna initially return it back to Amazon and I'll just have my daughter, she can sit on it, she can bounce with me. You know, she just likes doing stuff with me, so I'm gonna just go ahead and keep it and have her bounce on it. I need to put some more air into this one, so that's what I'm about to do. And then I'm about to eat my food in a little bit. My dad just dropped off some food, y'all. He always feeding me. I'm about to go ahead and eat my food. Let's see what it is. I know it's a sandwich, um, and I think it's like some type of gyro sandwich. So we'll see, I'm not sure. I don't even know where he went. I don't even know the name of the place. Tell me that I don't look good. It ain't gotta look good to y'all, but it's good to me. So I got cheese, that's gyro meat, that's like green peppers, um, orange peppers, and some onions and jalapeno peppers. Yeah, it's fire. Mm -hmm. It's really good. I gotta figure out where he got this from. I think I'm gonna only eat half of this. And then I'm gonna go pick up my daughter from daycare. Oh my God, there's so much meat on here. It just keeps falling. All right, y'all, I'm about to finish this sandwich, half of it, and I'll see y'all later. All right, y'all, so now I'm in the car. I'm on my way to go pick up my big girl from daycare. And then we're gonna stop at my dad's house for a little bit. Say hi. hi. <laughs> try to fake mad. Don't mind my baby hair, okay? We try to do the natural, okay? The puffs and stuff. You want chicken nuggets? Yeah. She, I want chicken nuggets. She can chicken live off chicken nuggets. All right, y'all, so we just pulled up to my dad's house. She got her Wendy's. I just knew I want for the cook since I already ate. But we got some chicken nuggets. We got some, a Frosty, the um, new strawberry Frosty. We're gonna try it out. Pretty sure it's gonna be busty. You ready to go to Papa House? Yep. I'm really just about to go take a nap over yeah, here. Mommy. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. Yeah, I'm in the car, I'm on my way to the hospital. I think I'm gonna have baby girl today. I'm in labor, my mucus plug came out. I had some bleeding yesterday, minor bleeding today. I've been having cramps, contractions, stomach tightening up since like 2 a.m. See what's up, ma? Hi. Hopefully baby will be here soon. Hopefully. We've been waiting on this day. A week late. Yep, she's a week late. The ship has been holding up pretty good though. Yeah. These contractions ain't no joke, but they were like every 10 minutes, but since I got up and started getting my daughter ready for daycare, I don't know where my contractions is at. I just had one before we got in the car. But I will see you guys when we get to the hospital. All right, you guys made it to the hospital. And I changed. As you guys can see. <sighs> yeah, she's in my hospital room. And it's nice. It's big. Really, really big. I just asked them if they can bring me an um, uh, exercise ball so I can bounce on. 
so we'll see. My contraction is like slowing down a little bit, but still having them. Here's everything. Alright, so a little update you guys. I got checked to see if the baby head was down the right way, right position. Got checked to see if I was dilated. So I'm only dilated one centimeter. And so they're gonna give me a couple of hours to see if I'm gonna dilate more. Otherwise, I have to think about getting induced because I am 41 weeks. And so I don't wanna go on too much longer with you know keeping baby in my tummy because there can be health complications and things like that. But I think, you know, if I'm not dilated in a couple of hours, then I'm gonna go ahead and get induced. But I'm currently just bouncing on this ball, this exercise ball, just trying to keep moving. And I'm uploading a video for you guys. <laughs> These contractions is coming in still every like seven minutes. I've been timing them. So, I'm gonna keep bouncing on this. I'm gonna give me something to eat. And this TV is a little, we got the TV going too. So, that's what y'all hear in the background. So, I hope y'all can hear me. Keep updating you guys here and there. And then, I'm gonna go ahead and walk around in a little bit. Just trying to keep moving so I can make sure that the baby is moving down. So, yeah, I really wanna avoid medicine, but it is what it is. If that's what I have to do, then that's what I have to do. But if I do get induced, I won't be able to do a water birth. So that's just the downside of that. So yeah. But I'll keep you guys updated. And I'll be back in a little bit. I think she's having another contraction. You guys, I did it. It is the next day, but I had my baby girl last night. Late last night at 12:05 a.m. Eight pounds, four ounces, 20 and a half inches long. Yeah, it was time for her to come, little big baby. I'm exhausted. I'm super tired. She's fussing right now, so I think she's hungry. So I'm gonna, I'm breastfeeding, so I'm gonna put her on my boot. Um, I did not get epidural, so yeah, I do not recommend. <laughs> just because I was in labor for so long. Oh my gosh, I just scared. I'm so happy, you guys. So happy that all of this is over with, and I'm just so happy that I finally get to meet my baby girl. I haven't got her washed up yet, and I need to wash up myself. I need to eat and get some more sleep. So, I'm gonna try to do all that pretty soon here. I'll see y'all later. So, I just washed up, took a shower, 
And now I got some food. I just ordered some food from the cafeteria. The food is really not that good, but um, it'll do. Um, Elliot is not here. He won't be able to make it until Saturday, unfortunately, which is tomorrow. So we'll see him tomorrow. I'm gonna show you guys my breakfast that I got. I ended up ordering. I started eating already, but I got some hash brown, an omelet, my blueberry muffin. That's some blueberry yogurt. And this omelet, it has just like spinach, sausage, cheese, onion, and green bell peppers. And that's it. So, yeah, we're finna try it out. Hopefully, it's good. It has browns, is decent. But, y'all, just wanted to update you guys, let you guys know what's going on. So, so far, Dev did like all the tests and everything for a baby girl. And I've been breastfeeding pretty well and i just got done pumping on that machine right there but here's baby ilani you guys she is looking just like her daddy she's really just her big sister all over again her big sister when she was a baby looked just like her dad but now she's starting to look like me so i'm guessing this is just that all over again but i hope you guys have enjoyed this video make sure you guys go ahead and like comment and subscribe definitely like this video if you enjoyed it and leave me a comment in the comment section if you have any questions about anything um but yeah i'll see you guys on the next video